Welcome back everyone and welcome to the season 3 finale of my Manchester United career on FIFA 16. Just two games remain. Up first, we're at Anfield to take on Liverpool in the final Premier League game of the season. The title could be won or lost there. Who is going to lift it? Will it be City? Will it be Liverpool? Or will it be Manchester United once again? And then finally, we've got the Champions League final against Arsenal. Here we are then, Anfield, the final game of the Premier League. Can we lift the title for the second season in a row? You'll never walk alone, ringing around Anfield for the final time this season as both sets of players walk out onto the pitch for the final time this season. Ready to do battle, Liverpool, Manchester United. We could be looking at the potential champions this season. All depends on the scoreline here and also at the Etihad between Man City and Aston Villa. we just got to make sure we can get the job done here today and fingers crossed that Villa pull off a decent result there. doesn't matter whether it's a draw or if they win, as long as we get the win. The three points here against Liverpool. Their lineup looks like this. Mignolet in goal. They've got Benteke, Sturridge, Lalana, Milner. They all start. Last time we played Liverpool back at Old Trafford, it ended 0-0 where we had two players sent off. It's unbelievable how he managed to hold in there and Schneidlin was one of those players that got sent off. He starts today with Mata, Gareth Bale, Wayne Rooney, Romelu Lukaku. They all start ready to do battle. I'm so looking forward to this. The final day of the Premier League season for season three with Manchester United. I think we're all set here. I'm ready. I hope you guys are ready as well. well here come Liverpool early on in the game. It's Benteke now. Finding Lalana, who's got a bit of space. He's worked that through for Daniel Sturridge, and he is offside, but De Gea did save. Very even so far as we've started off this game. Gareth Bale. Yes, go on, Rooney. Bale releases Rooney. Can we make something happen? Bit of magic, bit of quality. You can see Mata making a run into the box. Can we bring that back inside? Looking for Herrera. Oh, pretty tense at the moment. And I've said that multiple times this season, but it really is. Oh, here we go, Rooney. Oh, it's just the ball pinballing all over the place. Thiago going to clear that, yep. And that's going to be a United throw. It's not very often I get goosebumps over a game. But this fixture here, the final game of the season, I certainly have. And that, oh, Moreno with a hefty challenge on Lukaku. Oh, it's a straight red. Oh, my God. Talk about drama on the final day of the season. Liverpool at such a disadvantage now. They're down to 10 men. We're, well, we're just coming up to the break. 38 minutes gone. And was that a straight red? Oh, he got a touch on the ball, but the studs are showing Lukaku did go down. Haven't heard much about the game over at the Etihad between City and Villa, so... Should be half time. Can we make it 1 0 here with Gareth Bale? It's a good, effective shot on target. Mignolet forced to make the save. That is half time at Anfield. It's Liverpool 0, Manchester United 0. We're going to go find out what the score is between City and Villa. I'm hoping that Villa have maybe managed to get a goal in there somewhere. And oh no. No, no, no. Man City. They're beating Villa 2-0 at half-time. This is certainly not looking good because as it stands, Man City are this season's Premier League champions. Stealing the trophy off us. We, we just have to make sure we get, get the job done here today and hope Villa pull through. Rooney. Oh, Lukaku was never going to get to that. And Skirtle that was in the way. And now Liverpool looking to break with the pace of climb, but maybe not. Go for a shot here with Rooney. Oh, deflection. Well, considering Liverpool are down to 10 men, well, you wouldn't think they were at such a disadvantage the way they've gone about business in the second half. And now Daniel Sturridge, <gasps> no, 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 oh, Jones with the clearance. That was going in. If Jones wasn't there, it was going to be 1-0. But look at the pace we're hitting Liverpool on the break now on the counter. Rooney back to Lukaku. Come on, can we make it 1-0 here? Schneidlin back to Herrera. Oh, I've wasted too much time. Really took the momentum out of that attack. But Rooney, can he get a shot away? No, he can't. What a waste. And here come Liverpool yet again. He's going to whip this in. He's found storage. Oh, my God. I thought that was in. It's all over. It's ended nil-nil here. Unless we could get a very, very late goal. Sure. Up to Memphis. Yes. Oh, no. What about doing? Rooney was in space. Oh, my God. I've blown it. 
I've blown this season's league title. We just didn't do enough here at Anfield. All the Liverpool fans, all the Manchester United fans sat down. Are probably leaving the ground early as well after Man City have probably gone on to beat Villa. We haven't won the league title here today. It's ended Liverpool nil, Manchester United nil. Just a point for both teams. And if City have won, well, even if they was to have drawn against Villa, they would have won the league title after today's result here at Anfield. There is the final confirmation. Chelsea and Everton, Spurs and Watford still yet to play their final game of the season, but you can see that Man City have won the league title after we drew against Liverpool at Anfield. A bit deflating, I thought, you know, maybe we could have pipped City and Liverpool to the title this season and win it for a second season in a row, but just wasn't to be. We move on anyway. We've got to turn our attention to what I've been focusing mainly on this season, and that's the Champions League. We've done so well to get to the final. We're in the final now. We've got to play Arsenal, who we've already beaten a couple of times over the course of this career mode with United. I'm feeling pretty confident. You can see that Hull, Derby, Stoke, they've all been relegated. Let's move on. It's Arsenal against Manchester United. It's the Champions League final. I did want to use the Champions League theme, but I'd probably get a copyright strike. Look at this. Two teams that have done so well to get to the final. It's good to see that it's an all-English Champions League final as well. Don't get them very often, but when they do come around, you're always guaranteed entertainment to its max. There is Rooney, who takes the captain's armband for today. Both teams fully fit after having a week and a half rest for this Champions League final. So, again, I'm expecting fireworks. you got Mata, Bale, Lukaku all in the side today. Can I win the Champions League for the first ever time on FIFA 16? Now is the time. There is Arsenal's lineup: Giroud, Wilshere, Sanchez, Walcott. Such pace going forwards. Ramsey and Verratti in central midfield for Manchester United De Gea starts in goal it has to with Coleman Jones and uh, Blind at the back Smalling just wasn't up to scratch for this game the Schneidman midfield returns with Gareth Bale Rooney uh, Mata and Lukaku going forwards I remember surprising myself in my first season here with United here on FIFA 16 getting to the final of the Champions League but we came up short against PSG it was Angel Di Maria former United player that stopped us from lifting that piece of silverware here we go now can we make something happen here no that put a stop to our our counter but coleman gets past his man getting chased down though who is this that's putting me under some pressure rooney on for bale can always count on bale to do something here for united Rooney, oh it's a deflection check, saves, and a pretty dull start to the Champions League final, oh Giroud's away here, come on Dali Blins, well done, no, still not clear the danger, and Alexis at the far post, almost headed in the ball, trying to do something from the set piece, sad set pieces lately, they've been pretty on point, can we make them pay this time, maybe with Rooney, oh, just looking to sneak the ball into the bottom corner, Kieran Gibbs picking up the loose ball. What's he up to? He's going to cross in a nasty looking ball. And a here with a good save. Plucks it out of the air. And Schweinsteiger. Well done. Batting off the challenge there. Of Ramsey, I think it was. Matic can whip this in. Look at the space for Rooney on the volley. Oh. No. He needed to do so much better. Can you just imagine that going in? It would have been sweet. Manalas. Ramsey, well won Rooney, here we go now, now we're cooking, yes Bale, he is through, come on we need to make it 1-0 here, oh he's hit the post, come on, how is it not 1-0, Verratti to Giroud, some direct passing going on here for Arsenal, oh my god, Walcott disappointed with that. Maybe he was open, but Ramsey decided to go for goal. But what a save from the world's best goalkeeper, Seamus Coleman. He's had Sanchez in his back pocket all game so far. Oh! oh. De Gea route to the spot there. We are into the second half. Oh, no. What a poor pass to 
Theo Walcott feeds that through the middle. And De Gea again with an incredible save. Nicely done, Matter. On for Schneidlin now. Lukaku who hasn't really done much. Hasn't been very effective. Good shot from Rooney. Arsenal now. In the corner. De Gea making it look easy. Simple catching practice because I'm not sure where that was going. Looking for Lukaku but it's Wilshire. He sticks out his foot, controls it well. Now Arsenal passing the ball around. No wonder they beat Barcelona if they were playing like that. Here we go. Gareth Bale, who's moved over to the right. Just try and get past our man here now. Oh, look at the options. Lukaku, yes. On for Memphis. Finesse. Oh, it's got in. It's Memphis who puts United. 1-0 up against Arsenal in this season's Champions League final. Oh my god, we're not far away now from lifting the Champions League trophy. Can you just imagine if I can do this? Gareth Bale starting things off. Oh, look at that little back kick from uh, Lukaku. And what a finish from Memphis Depay on the finesse. Lovely, 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 lovely stuff into the top left-hand corner. 1-0 then to Manchester United. Still plenty of time for Arsenal to get back in. Expecting Arsenal to go like the Clappers night. They've only got one guy back in defence. The rest all up top here. And, oh, Memphis almost got a header onto that. And it's Gibbs that goes for the goal. Seconds. Seconds to go. Come on, lads. Can we make it 2-0 here with Schneider to really put the game to bed? Check with the save. It's all over, ladies and gentlemen. I've finally done it. I feel like crying. I've finally done it. I have won the Champions League for the first time now here on FIFA 16. It's only took my third season with United to do it. And it's that guy, Memphis Depay, that wrapped things up here against Arsenal. We are the Champions League winners. What an incredible feeling. The players, I, I'm actually surprised we got this far uh, with the team that I had. I didn't think we would because I only, I sold the likes of Christian Eriksen, if you guys remember, and and Patrick Herman to have like a fresh change. Brought in Gareth Bale, Romelu Lukaku and Coleman. They were my three main signings in the summer and that was it. I never thought I would get to this stage anyway uh, with a team like this. But here we are. We're in the final. We've won it. We've beaten Arsenal. It's an incredible feeling. So this season's Champions League winners are Manchester United. Get in. Incredible scenes. It's good to have Rooney lifting the trophy as well. Once more for Manchester United. I think with that, folks, that's probably going to be the end of this career mode with United. I want to try out some fresh things. I want to be going on to um, Ultimate Team, doing a series with that, focusing on that as well. I know a lot of you guys have been requesting that. And I'm thinking of doing a new team as well for career mode, just to freshen things up on the channel instead of it always being Manchester United. So I hope you guys will stay tuned for that. New episodes to come soon. I do have the team selected. I have already started recording, so it's evil of me, I know, but you guys are just going to have to stay tuned to find out. And I hope it's going to be another series for you guys to sink your teeth into. Anyway, folks, that's going to be it from me for this Manchester United career on FIFA 16. I do hope you've all enjoyed. Thank you for your support, and I'll see you all soon for the next one.